Hey y'all, I am back with another video. Don't forget to like, comment down below if you have any questions or, you know, you want to know something. I read all my comments. Um, hit that notification bell and, you know, let me know if you like this video because I don't know if you don't, if you don't like it, so, or dislike it. <laughs> all right. So, this story is going to be about the time I got flew out to Hawaii. And All right. So, at the time I was working at this club. It was a popular club. Like a lot of girls was there, whatever. Dudes used to come through. Like hella dudes. And it was cool. Like, I don't know. I didn't, it was, I was young. Like, it was cool. You know, you going out, it's a party. Like, you know, like, it's a club. Like, so I met this dude and he was like, oh, you know, he was feeling me or whatever. He was like, oh, I want to take you. Like, I want to, I want to take you out or whatever. I want to take you here. I want to take you there or whatever. I'm like, okay, that's what's up. Like, that's cool. Like, you know. So, I end up. At first, I didn't really like the dude. Because I'm like, hold on. Like, that's weird. Like, why you want to just take me out? You know what I'm saying? I don't really know you like that. You got to watch out. Because people was crazy. Got to watch out. But. Um, I, he kept coming around, so I got more comfortable with him. So I felt like, okay, damn. All right, let me go. You know what I'm saying? I'm comfortable with you. I feel like, okay, I'm cool. Like, you know, everybody know where I'm at. They know your license plate. They know, got a picture of you and all that. Make sure you, you know what I'm saying, ladies? Okay, get the license plate. Get the phone number, send everything. <laughs> I'm just saying, just in case. If you ever going somewhere, make sure you let people know where you're going. Because if there nobody know, I'm just saying. <laughs> but anyway, um, so I'll let everybody know where I'm go Let You know, I, I, I feel comfortable with him. So when he was like, oh, let me take you out or whatever. Let me, let's go, let's take a trip. I was like, okay, let me take a trip. Fuck it. He was like, let's let's go to Hawaii. It's not out the country, but this was my first time going on a plane to Hawaii. This is my first time going on a plane. I normally just drive, me and my people normally just drive to Vegas. You know what I'm saying? We ain't getting on an hour flight. We just drive, you know what I'm saying? It ain't that big of a deal. So, you know, this is this would be my first time on the plane going to Hawaii. We went to um, Honolulu and we stayed at um, what was it? The um, Waikiki Ambassador Waikiki or some shit like that. And we went to the um, we, we also, you know, went to the Royal Hawaiian. It was cool. Like, the Royal Hawaiian Hotel it was cool. They had, it was nice. It was nice. But it started getting weird because, <clears throat> not necessarily weird because, I won't say weird, but it, to, for me it started getting weird because he was making it like we cool, like, you know, we cool. <laughs> and people going to be in the comments like, girl, you knew, you knew he was, was, was up. <laughs> And don't be saying that shit because I didn't know. I was young and dumb. <laughs> I 
I didn't know. I was like, shit, he liked me. We finna fly out here. We finna just be cool. We finna go out. We finna eat and shit. We finna go shopping. And it's gonna be fun. You know? That's what we, that's what you wanted to do. Like, that's what you said. You went, why you pick me? Shit, you could have picked anybody. Or whatever. So I'm like, damn, you, and you kept coming with it. You know what I'm saying? So you picked me. Like, it wasn't like, oh. Like, I'm going to ask one time. We, he kept asking me, like, we finna go. Or whatever. And, um. I don't know, like, he just started giving me, like, a weird, like, vibe, and we went, it was fun, like, we, we stayed a few days, and you know what's crazy, I lost my fucking job, because I was out there too long, it's crazy, but, I didn't need to work there no more, but, <laughs> still, I was mad, I was heated, like, what the fuck, like, I'm trying to go home and shit, but he was, like, being weird, and, he didn't want to, like, okay, so I wasn't giving up the, you know, I wasn't giving it up. Because I'm irritated, like, why is you, like, acting weird? You know what I'm saying? Be, keep that shit a uh, bean, like, keep that shit 100. Like, say what you mean and mean what you say. Don't fucking have me out here acting like we cool and we hunt, we friends and shit. And it's, you know, <laughs> maybe I was just done, but. Whatever, I don't care. You live and you learn. But don't be having me out here thinking that, you know, we, we cool. We hanging out. We finna turn up and your ass are mad at me because I'm at the pool. And I'm not laid up with you. Like, I'm not finna be doing that. I'm in, I'm in uh, Honolulu, baby. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not finna be doing that. I'm not. I'm not going to. Sorry. And it was crazy because... At one point, I was like, you know what? I need to book a flight because I'm not going to wait on this person that's getting on my nerves to um, get me back home. You know what I'm saying? You That's why you have to have your own money, too. Don't go nowhere with just relying on somebody else. That's stupid. Never go somewhere and you don't have no money. If you don't have no money, don't go. Because... If um, if it's an emergency and you gotta get out of the motherfucking roll out the cab, you know what I'm saying? You gotta tuck and roll on the motherfucker, then you got your money. But if you ain't got no money and you in the car, you looking sad. I'm just saying, make sure you got your own money. But I didn't, if, thank God I, had, I didn't have to deal with that because he wasn't being, when it was time to go, he, okay, so. Let me say how I lost my job. We were supposed to leave like on, I think like Sunday or something. We stayed for like a week. We were supposed to leave on Sunday. And something happened to where he was like, I, and I had to be on at work. I already been, been, been calling off, okay? Because we stayed till Sunday. And this job that I was working it ain't really like you could just call off like that. You have to come in, you know, they not finna be tolerating all this calling off and all this shit. Like, it ain't no P.O. time or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That time that you get when you, you know, that build up time, ain't none of that. They're like, nah, bitch, you need to be here or you gonna lose your position. And, um... I'm calling out and shit, and they giving me chances and shit, giving me chances. And we didn't get back till, like, I want to say, like, Wednesday or something. We didn't get back, like, literally till, like, Wednesday. And I'm telling my job, and they're like, nah. <laughs> I'm telling them where I'm at, too. So they really like, nah, like, girl, you know why? They like, nah, we ain't, ain't nobody playing with you. Like, you don't care about this job. You got enough money to go to Hawaii. You don't need to work here. So they fucking fired me. They fired me. But I went somewhere else. But that's another three time. I ain't gonna get into that. But if y'all like this video and y'all wanna hear more about my um 
you know, that club life that I was working at. That shit is crazy. If y'all want to hear more about that, just, you know, drop it in the comments. And I could let you guys know about that. Um, that's going to be the end of this story time. But thanks for watching, y'all. Peace. <laughs>